Hey, what's up? I am Sandy, and in this episode, wait, before I even start. In this video, I'll be showing you how I pick up my BMW R65 custom build. Black, keep the Toyota. Review about the Chotec. Switching over to the 787. So if you remember, I took my bike to be fixed two weeks ago. I had to have some carburetors done and I had a wobble in my back wheel. So you can actually see the video right here. Uh, I'm gonna take, uh, I'm gonna dress up, change my uh, clothes, put on some protective gear and go get my bike. Sean is gonna help me. She's gonna be driving my truck, the FJ. And together we're gonna go get the, the bike and show you around. Okay, so we're on our way now uh, to Patterson to pick up the bike. Uh, Chris is the mechanic. He has his own shop uh, in, in this workshop that he rents, I guess, uh, some space. Has four or five Harleys over there. Got a few lifts and he's been working on the bike for two weeks now. Uh, we did, he did a lot of stuff that I couldn't do myself. He finished up the wiring for the, for the speedometer and tachometer. He felt, it fixed uh, the wobble in my wheel, in back wheel that I had. He did put in, uh, he serviced the carburetors. I actually bought on eBay two, two carburetors that fit uh, the BMW R65 that I have. So he, he uh, serviced them, put them in on. Then he also said that I need some, uh, of course, oil change, valve adjustment. So we're doing that as well. And believe it or not, I, I took the bike in uh, when I, when I uh, powder, powder coated the wheels to black. Uh, the local uh, motorcycle shop took the bearings out and when he put them back in, he messed up the spacer so it was wobbling. So I said, oh, at this time I'm going to go to BMW. I went to BMW, dropped $200 and uh, they came back exactly the same thing. They put new, they put new bearings inside, but they messed up the spacers. So this guy, no official dealership. No uh, logo on his shop, just, you know, a garage with uh, two lifts, did a better job than all the mechanics that I had the bike with. Bruh. There it is. John's this is where it all started when we originally brought the bike we brought it here <sighs> Runs nicely. I mean it does need a tune-up the, the carburetors need to be worked on idle seems a little bit high but this is going to be uh, my project for the next uh, few months till it's spring. So I'm going to do a walk around soon and show you what it looks like. So let me, uh, so John is, John is a little bit too busy right now getting his body decorated. Wow! So I'm going to walk you around, uh, show you what's new, what they did. So this whole cluster I took off I put in this uh, speedometer one piece a digital and I didn't know how to f uh, finish up the wiring so he did everything made everything nice and tidy and put it wherever it's supposed to be apparently one of my shocks there was uh, the seal the seal over here uh, inside was leaking so they took everything out and uh, put new seals in. They service the shock absorbers. 
what else did they do? I'm gonna be finishing up this, uh, removing, uh, putting a, I got a battery, a small anti-gravity uh, battery. I'm gonna put it under the seat. So right now it's slightly messy, but that's, uh, oh yeah, of course, carburetors. Two new, uh, two new carburetors that were serviced. Now they're matching, as you can see. What else? The, oh, the wobble. Remember if the, the back wheel was wobbling? That's it, they fixed the bearings inside, the spacers inside, and apparently there was the same problem in the front. So that was done. Oil change, of course, and that's it. What do I have? I have a few things to do myself now. I got uh, mirrors to go on the handlebar, on the end of the handlebars. I'm gonna put them in myself, both sides. Work on the battery, of course. And, oh yeah, he had, uh, he had to do uh, the valve adjustment. Valves were completely off, they were knocking. So now it's nice and clear. Let me start it up and you can hear. Oh, I like that. Like those tires. So is that badass or what? It's really cool. So that is for now. Thank you for watching. I am Sandy. Please give me a like, share. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe that logo, that circle. I am Sandy. Until the next time, thank you.